you are willing to take the journey. The Bible says, go into the world and make disciples. Amen. When you came into Christ, you became born again. Hallelujah. Discipleship is a process. Discipleship is a journey. Amen. Now, some people are saying in their mind, I love to. I love to have this kind of relationship. But I can't. I can't. And I just want to tell you this morning. I can't is the biggest excuse ever invented. It's the biggest excuse ever invented. As soon as you start telling yourself I can't, guess what? You can't. Amen. Because what excuse that you are willing to accept, that excuse that you are willing to accept, that's what's going to become your eyes are. Everybody still with me this morning. That excuse that you always put forward to say, I can't, I can't, I can't. Guess what? That is your eyes up. And God is speaking to your heart this morning. I said, that I can't. That I can't. That eyes up. Give it to me this morning. Why? Because I want to know you deeper. Because I want you to know me deeper. I want us to have this sweet fellowship together. Hallelujah. Somebody stay with me? Don't worry about the kids, they are okay. Amen. Hallelujah. Amen. Somebody say amen. 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 Okay. Somebody is also saying this morning, you know what? I really like to have this kind of relationship with God. But for me, it's a no-no. And you say, why is it a no-no? He said, because I was born this way. Because all my life, all my history, this is how I was born. I wasn't meant to have this relationship with God. I want to tell you, that is the greatest lie ever invented. Amen. That is the greatest lie ever invented. You know why? Because that's why you became born. Okay. Amen. Amen. I don't care what has happened. I don't care how you were born. Let's put all that aside. The Bible says, if any man be in Christ, he's a new Christian. Hallelujah. He's born again. He's born into a new life, into a new life of power. But the problem is, some people have already made up their mind. Therefore, they say, instead of moving forward in this journey, instead of taking a new step and a new leap, you say, that's how I was born. Hallelujah. I never had a relationship with my father, my earthly father. My mother never wanted me. My father never did this. My mother never did all that. But again, I remind you, that's why you are born again. Amen. Hallelujah. All things are passed away. All things have become new. The problem is, all things have become new, but so many of us keep going back and drag those old things and bring them along. And Jesus is saying, I've made you new, I've made you afresh. No, 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 I need to bring some of this. Hallelujah. And that's why God is speaking to me this morning. That path that you are holding on to, that excuse that you're giving, I want you to lay it today. I want you to lay it today at the altar. Because I'm willing. Hallelujah. You see, in your brain, your brain has got what we call a processing center. 